War is not a solution and bombs and missiles cannot ensure peace. With these words, Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi assured Vladimir Putin that his country is ready for any assistance to establish peace in Ukraine. Every person who believes in humanity feels the pain when they see death, especially when innocent children are killed. As Modi's two-day visit to the Russian capital draws to a close, the Indian side boasts some lucrative contracts are in the bag. But there was more to this visit, including many sensitive issues like relations with China and the supply of Russian weapons and oil. The agenda was overloaded with issues, I would say. And there were actually three set of questions discussed. Obviously, number one is bilateral issues with focus on trade and economy, which is booming. Uh, second was uh, global issues related to BRICS, to Shanghai uh, Organization Cooperation, and also uh, adding to that, uh, separately, uh, both leaders discussed Ukrainian crisis and, and the ways to resolve it. Many agree India is using a window of opportunity which has opened for it after the beginning of the Ukrainian conflict. The two countries' goal now is to reach a trade turnover of up to $100 billion by 2030. Modi agreed with Putin to bring home his compatriots, Indians who were lured into the Russian army and found themselves on the battlefield in Ukraine. He was also given Russia's highest civilian award by President Putin. With your direct support, the largest Russian-Indian project in the trade, economic and military technical spheres, high technology and space are being successfully implemented. The meeting comes as part of Russia's ongoing engagement with its allies. Last week, Vladimir Putin was meeting with the Turkish and Chinese presidents at the Shanghai Cooperation Organization meeting in Astana. And then he was hosting Hungarian Premier Viktor Orban in Moscow discussing Ukraine. In fact, many countries continue cooperating with Russia despite the Ukrainian conflict. And Russia is still a long way from being as isolated as the West had hoped. Prime Minister Modi's visit has demonstrated that the Kremlin, despite India's deepening relations with the United States, maintains a close strategic partnership with India that dates back to Soviet times. Yulia Shapovalova, Al Jazeera, Moscow. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.